Hi everyone, welcome back. Louis Patello here, PGA Professional. Uh, firstly, I want to thank everyone who has been tuning in through the lockdown to my videos. Uh, thank you for everyone who has subscribed to my channel. Uh, once again, if we have any comments or if there's any questions that people out there need answering, let's put it in that comment box down below. So, we just got out the weekend, it's Tuesday. Uh, also, let me know uh, how everyone's indoor practice or practice around the yard has been going, if people have been hitting balls. Uh, let me know what you've been working on out there. Uh, maybe we could do some videos towards that and see if we can tighten the game down. So today, what I want to talk about is hip sliding. So for all my guys and girls out there who hip slide, they make back swings and their hips work in a linear motion without any rotation. Got a great simple drill for you today. I'm in my dining room and I'm going to move one of my chairs out and I'm going to put it on my right hip. So if I take my posture, I can do it with my arms down or across my chest, however you feel comfortable, and I make a backswing. If I try to slide, you can see that chair is going to impact me. So what I need to try to do is by keeping my hip on the chair on my right, I need to make a back swing where almost my right hip works away from the chair a little bit rather than driving into the chair. On the other side of that drill, if you're someone that slides into the golf ball, I can also put one on my left hip too. So I could really practice not hitting the chair this way. And Thirdly, if you're someone that slides both ways, we can actually use a double drill here. So we can actually put a chair on both hips and we can start to get back to kind of that feeling that people would speak about when they spoke about swinging in a barrel. And that basically means trying to keep the body rotary without moving left and right. So we've got our chair on both sides. We can make a golf swing without disturbing those chairs. That's my tip of the day. Have fun. More importantly, stay safe out there.